Hey guys, Kristen with Mixed Wellness. I wanted to briefly go over and give you a quick little orientation to this wonderful reference guide that um, I gifted to you when you enrolled with the Premium Starter Kit with me or a member of my team. This is an amazing resource. It's kind of a must-have in your arsenal um, of essential oil stuff. Um, it is your first and last um, stop for becoming your own personal health care uh, advocate. And it'll help to navigate the world of essential oils um, when your sponsor just simply can't respond to you right away. So, um, quickly I'll show you the main pages that I, that I refer to. And I kind of wish I had this um, orientation when I first got started. I received the book and um, it was awesome, but I wasn't really quite sure how to navigate it. So it took me a while to really figure out the ins and the outs of it. Um, so the first area that I want to show you is a single oils directory. Just list by page the um, various essential oils. Uh, these are just single oils, like one type of oil, for example, lavender, single oil. Um, then the next page is the blends directory. Now blends are just blends of uh, different essential oils um, that Young Living has created based on their uh, molecular properties, their benefits, etc. So that's just listed by, um, by page here. Then the next section after the... Um, the blends is the personal usage directory that's right after the blends and that is basically your index so instead of it being in the end of the um, book it's actually in the beginning that's what really screwed me up I was looking for things and I couldn't find them because they were in the middle so anyway so this is your personal usage directory so if you have something that you want to look up look it up in the personal usage directory and then it'll give you the page number that it's at so for example um, Abuse, mental and physical. That's the very first one. So you would just go to page 220. So, um, okay, then it goes into kind of the nerdy stuff. So if you're into all the ins and the outs of what essential oils are, the chemistry, um, it kind of talks about that. So if you want to read up on that, you certainly can. Um, the next area is chapter four. Now, chapter four is just basically all of the single oils and the specific details about the single oils, how to use them, what they're used for, etc. Then the next section is chapter five, same thing, oil blends. So these are just the blends and it goes into the various um, systems that these oil blends have, how to use them, and some little recipes in there as well. And then the next area that I wanna show you is the Vitaflex um, points on the feet. Now you know that there are like 2,000 different pores uh, within the foot and it's a great place for the oils to be able to absorb and really, really get some great benefits to your body. So Vitaflex points are here um, in your book. So you can either look online, you can just go to Google and, and look for Vitaflex points, or you can just look in your book on page 190. The next section is the personal usage section. Now this is going back to the very beginning where you were looking up abuse, mental or physical, you're going to find all of that in here in this personal usage directory or this personal usage section. This is the largest section and it has everything listed here. Then at the end, there are a couple appendixes. Appendix A is really kind of cool. This one is the product usage for body systems. So it lists out all of the different body systems that each oil impacts. It's really awesome. And then last but not least is some uh, single oil data. So if you're looking for information about um, Ylang Ylang um, and the botanical name, if you're interested in that, you can find out that Ula Balance has that. So pretty cool. So now why and how would you use this? Well, for example, I'm not here to diagnose, treat, prescribe, cure, anything like that. Um, but if you were just, per, for example, looking up something um, to use an oil for, let's just say... Um, Let's find a good example that is um, compliant. <laughs> um, let's see, let's see. Um, hmm. Okay, let's just go back to to find compliant things these days. Abuse, mental and physical. Let's just go back to our very first one, page 220. 220. So you would go to your the page that you're looking for, whatever, whatever thing you're looking for the oil to help with, um, and then it'll list out, you know, kind of a, some information about what abuse is, mental and physical abuse, and then it'll recommend the oils that, that are recommended for it. 
In this example, it's recommending for the singles. It's going to give you. It's going to list the single oils as well as the blends. Um, so this is Franken Sacred Frankincense, Frankincense, Idaho Balsam, Fir, Sandalwood, Melissa, Elang Elang, and Amazonian Elang Elang. And it also um, recommends for blends: Trauma Life, Sarah, Release, Acceptance, Forgiveness, Surrender, Humility, White Angelica, Inner Child, Harmony, Hope, Tranquil Roll On, Valor, The Gift, Ula Grow, and Common Sense. So quite a few. Quite a few. So then you're like, oh my gosh, there are so many oils here. I don't even know where to begin. So what do I recommend? Well, first things first, what do you have on hand? And more than likely, if you have the premium starter kit, you have 11 essential oils that are super popular that can be used in many, many ways. They're very versatile. So more than likely, you have something from your premium starter kit for whatever ails you. In this example, it's recommending frankincense. Since you have the starter kit, you've got frankincense, so go with that. If you happen to have anything else that's listed here, go with that. You can make your own blends this way. It's kind of fun to kind of just play witch doctor and make your own blends um, based on what the person, uh, what the guide is telling you. That's what I like to do. That's how I like to do it. Um, and if something isn't working, then just go to the next one. So that's how I use the um, this wonderful resource that I have and that I like to give to my members. Um, if you have any questions, you can always um, contact me at mixwellness.com. And if you have any questions about how I use essential oils in my daily life, please um, visit mixwellness.com backslash oil. Thanks.